No gym, no equipment, no problem. Your girl over here has got you covered. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell by the title of this video, this is going to be a killer at home leg and booty workout. Absolutely no equipment is needed, but I did use a resistance band. You can find one on Amazon, that's where I got mine. You can find it at Walmart, Target. I feel like you can find these at literally any discount store or fitness store near you. This workout is going to be absolutely killer. I just want to remind you guys really quick that we are not here to look cute. During the workout, you ain't supposed to have the perfect hair. You're not supposed to always arch your back, you know what I'm saying? You need to be focused on squeezing. You need to be focused on that mind-muscle connection. You need to be going slow and controlled. You are going to break a sweat. I mean, I did. If you don't, then I mean you're way more advanced than I am, but I broke a sweat, so you're not supposed to look cute. I mean, yes, I am wearing a full face of makeup, but you know, just ignore that part. Just a reminder, we're here to work. You're here to work. You need to make sure that that booty looks as ugly as possible during your workout so it looks as nice as possible after your workout, you feel me? Before we get this workout started, make sure to follow me on all my social media. If you already do, then use a real one, and if you don't, then what are you doing? Go ahead, do that now. But without further ado, let's get this workout started. <laughs> Why are you liking it? So the first movement is donkey kicks. Great first movement to get that blood flowing to your glutes. If you need a bit more of a challenge, incorporate a resistance band or a dumbbell by placing it behind your knee. Sounds awkward, I know, but it works. Make sure to squeeze that muscle up top. Now moving on to frog pumps. Yes, that is the real name. This movement definitely needs to be taken more seriously, but sadly the name and the appearance of this exercise don't do it justice. Make sure to squeeze at the very top of this movement. It will burn in all the right places. These sliding lateral lunges are killer. You don't need a slider to get this workout done. Just get an old t-shirt and get to sliding. Plus it doubles as cleaning your floor. So I mean, two in one. It's a win-win situation. Now movement you should all know by now if you watch my channel, these are hip thrusts, one of my favorites for glutes. All you need is a chair, I'm using my little brother's piano seat and I put it against the door to make sure it was nice and stable. Last but not least, finish off with pulsing Bulgarian split squats. You can use a chair, a bed, anything to rest your back leg. Make sure to keep this movement slow and controlled and really feel it in your glutes on the way up.
work yet? I want to know. Comment down below if you tried this bad boy out. If this workout was just a tad bit too easy for you, then you can incorporate resistance bands. You can always go to Walmart, Target, even Craigslist, find some cheap dumbbells near you. Remember guys, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Comment down below what you wanna see next. I feel like the next thing I'm gonna do is going to be a little flex set review. Let me know if you guys wanna see that. If you just liked the video, comment down below and tell me why. Just, just try to be nice about it. I mean, just, just try to be nice. I mean, I take constructive criticism very well, but bullying, I don't take so well. So just be nice about it. Let me know what you disliked. Thank you so, so much for watching this video, and I'm going to see you in the next one.